since 09, I've put out my goals publicly. So 09 was freedom, 10 was invasion, 11 build empire, 12 grow wealth, 13 put the puzzle together, 14 buckle up, 15 make history, which is when we had the, the first New Year's Eve in Miami, 16 disruption, 17 gingerbread man plan, catch me if you can. And what we look to do with the artists that are involved this year was like, nah, you know what, we want to bring you back a little bit so you can understand. You, you can't understand the future if we're going to take you back in time a little bit. And at that time, at, at that time, we were partying, we were dancing, we were having a good yeah. time. It's different. I think now people, they get caught up so much with their phones and social media, and they're not really enjoying what this ride is really about. That's and that's true. what we're going to show you New Year's Eve. <laughs> <laughs> it's always about how we're going to have the most fun. So the people that we got involved in New Year's Eve this year, it's a true honor to be able to work with them, even share a stage with them, people such as Queen Latifah and Snoop, they're going to be hosting, have uh, Naughty by Nature, they're going to be performing, Salt and Pepper's going to be performing, which is, uh, you got to just keep it that classic tux, that's it. I, I give them that, that's when I become 00305 Armando Bond. <laughs> As far as the tradition, we would have this thing we call lechon en cajachino, where you get a, a, a pig and you put them on a grill, and then you, it's almost you, you cook them under Ooh. under the dirt. And it, yeah, it's, it's, it's weird. You got to dig a hole for it, uh -huh. and it just comes out really good. And you have yuca, which is uh, yuca. You have arroz frijoles, which is rice and beans, platanito, uh, frito. Mm -hmm. 